Oh my God. You guys have been incredible. I think we got one more song for you tonight, so if you know the words, feel free to scream along. One, two, three, four! Luxton County, step the fuck up! What about the motherfuckers in the back? Let me hear the motherfuckers in the back! Fucking mom, fucking dad, fucking fucking folks, man! I'll never listen to you! Let me fucking folks, man! Fucking phony underground, your artificial trust! I will never be a scared! Oh, fuck! What the fuck? What's going on back there? I gotta tune it to drop D for the chorus, bro. Well, what the fuck am I supposed to do? You don't do anything right now. It's Jay's drum solo. What? Since when? Ah, I emailed you the sheet music like sheet a week music? ago, dude. What the fuck you- Hey! Have? Rolling Stones! No more in chorus, okay? Rodney, your mom said you will help me bring those computers down the basement. Uh, thanks for the ride home, Mr. Castaneda. Rodney! What the hell is this kind of crap they're singing in front of everybody? What are you talking about? This, uh, fuck you, fuck the world, uh, oh my fuck God, your this mother, shit again. I want to fuck your dad, uh, that's not right, son. Uh, it's called social criticism, and what a shock. You missed the point entirely. I just don't understand when you get the ideas to say all these crazy things. Uh, you ever try reading a book, maybe? You've been talking to that crazy duck again, haven't you? Uh, that one that runs the convenience store. Okay, first of all, I literally don't even you know what you're talking about. got a one eye, a hook hang, conspiracy theorist. So you see, the subterranean mole people are actually working directly with high-ranking executives in the music industry. Mm-hmm, yeah. Ever wonder where your CDs come from? Well, that's all handled in the mole man labor camps. Once you dig about- Oh, okay, so just because he likes to stay informed, he's a conspiracy theorist. Got it. All I'm saying, Rodney, is you gotta learn how to present yourself to people. <sighs> yeah, I get it. You want me to be a suit? Well, leaving just a nice tie, you could cut your hair. You know, you're a good kid. But you wanna work for someone beside me someday? You gotta show a little bit of initiative, okay? Yay, wait, thank you for your help. Here, something for each of you. No problem, Mr. Castaneda. Rodney, I gotta pick your mother up from work. Call me if you need anything. Man, what a fucking asshole. You know, this is exactly what's wrong with the music scene. The only bands that get any attention is when somebody's fucking stepdad owns the label. Then when a band like ours comes along with something actually important to say, all my stepdad owns is a shitty computer repair store. Some people just have it made, you know? Shit just falls out of the sky for them. Hey, wait a minute. Jay, didn't you go to high school with the guy who runs Masonic Records now? No, no, dude, no, no. Different guy. There's a picture of you guys graduating together on his old blog. I, I mean, yeah, you know, so it's either way. Holy shit, bro, we got industry contacts? Jay, let me see your phone. What are you gonna do, just cold call him? Wade, sometimes you gotta show you know how to take the initiative. Hi, you've reached Wyatt Weasel at Masonic Records. Please leave a message after the beep. Hey, Wyatt. What's up, man? Uh, my name's Rodney. I'm in a band with your old friend Jay from high school. We're playing a show tomorrow afternoon at the Duck Mart downtown, and uh, we really think you're going to want to come check it out, because, frankly, it's going to make all the other acts on your label sound like dog shit. So, you know, definitely bring any other record execs who you think might be also, interested in that Also, if you know a guy who plays thing. bass, we really... Dude, shut the fuck up! Yeah, uh, anyway, show starts tomorrow at 2, and if you can't make it, well, there will be consequences. Gentlemen, you can thank me later. Where, where the fuck is everybody? Even those two homeless guys didn't show up, and I'm pretty sure they live here. Yeah, a lot of people go missing these days, it seems. <sighs> Almost like one day a man becomes of so little consequence, or maybe so much, that a crack must open in the foundation beneath them. A maw just big enough to fall inside. A pit of obscurity to toil away one's remaining years, serving the very engine that robbed you of your soul. Yeah, I know that. But what are we supposed to do about this? Don't wait to fall before you start screaming. Get your message to the people any way you can, while you can. 
That's why even now I'm out here talking to you guys instead of sanitizing the hot dog rollers. And so, to my colleagues at thrashforums.net, if you have any respect for me as a fellow guitarist or a fellow poster, I implore you to join me in boycotting all future releases from the Masonic Records. And then how do you think we should sign off here? Should I just be like, thanks for reading? Hmm. Can I get in there for a sec? Yeah, sure. And set. Wait, what? Thanks for reading. Also, Wyatt Weasel killed a guy back in the 80s? Uh, Rodney, I'm a very respected member of this online community. You can't just go around accusing a guy of murder. Why not? See? Don't worry, Wade. I'm making another account right now. We'll have that post back up in no time. Jay, go ahead and start plugging those other monitors in. It says there's six mods online right now, so we'll probably need to make at least seven new accounts per minute. As you can see, sir, in the last three hours, over 1,200 accounts have all sprung up, all of them making wild criminal accusations against you personally, ranging from indecent exposure to conspiracy to commit genocide. The way that I see it, Mr. Weasel, this is one of the most cut and dry cases of libel I've ever seen. I'll have the website down in no time. That won't be necessary. But, 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 sir, all you have to do is pick one of these demonstrably false accusations. Like, uh, like this one here. They're saying you installed a reverse trap door in your office. What is that even- Janice, give me the mole, people. Well, fellas, it was a lot of posting, but we finally got ourselves that record deal. No, we didn't. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, yeah, why did we do this again? Oh, shit! Oh, my God! Wait, 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 wait. Just hang on a second. We can talk about this. How's it going? Listen, I just wanted to say, I do feel a little bad about the whole situation with not returning your phone call and then having you guys enslaved by mole people. So, as a little way to say I'm sorry, here's $5 for each of you. All right, boys. Don't spend it all in one place. I'm just kidding. It's an underground prison. You can't leave! Now that guy is an asshole.
picture from posers, and there's something thinking that they hear from. Oh, 